What is up everybody and welcome back to the channel. So as you saw by the thumbnail, there's a new arrival here at the shop. Something very important to me, something really cool. Uh, it is not any of these. These have been here for a while. Uh, so the car was actually dropped off the other day. I was trying to get a video of it, getting come off the driveway and off the flatbed and all that kind of stuff. But uh, he kind of snuck up on me, dropped it off here, and I got like the tail end of it just being delivered off the flatbed. But anyway, um, so we're just gonna do kind of quick update on everything that's going on right now. Uh, I wasn't expecting that car back for a while. I was gonna shoot it probably like later on in the year. Um, I was gonna do a whole series on that, but it got back from the body shop. It was having uh, a crack fix in the quarter panel. It got done a lot faster than I thought. Um, so we're just gonna kind of spin off and do a series on that because it needs a bunch of stuff so I can get it back on the road and start driving it and enjoying it and stuff like that. Uh, so we're just gonna take a quick walk out to the shop. Um, we're gonna do some updates on the C4. Uh, I've been getting a lot of people asking about the coilovers. Um, pretty much, you know, uh, cost of it, what part numbers, all that kind of stuff. So I've been working on a list, uh, a very detailed list of every little item that I got. Um, I just finished that up. So I'm gonna put a video together with that. Um, I should have it, hopefully I'm gonna get that out within the next week or so. So anybody who's interested in buying coilovers for your car, um, I'll have that all ready and I'll have all the links. I got most everything from like Summit Racing. So I'll have all the links of that um, in the description. Um, so uh, the craziest thing is when I actually did the price for all the stuff for the coilovers on this car, that it was like way cheaper than I thought. I mean, I thought I was like thousands and thousands of dollars into it. And I kind of was at one point because I bought like two sets, like I think I was saying, if you watch the original video on the C4. Um, but doing the math on it, um, and there's probably ways that you could get it for like, well, like under a thousand bucks, everything. Um, so, but like I said, I'll have details about that in a video. Uh, I'm almost done with that. I got all the information. So that's gonna be pretty cool. So uh, look forward to that. Um, also too, uh, unfortunately back burner, I was gonna do a whole thing on my blue vet back there. Um, but like I said, I got this car that came in. Um, so look forward to, you know, I'm gonna just kind of throw in what I can here with these other builds, if you guys are following specifically for those. Um, but I think you guys are really gonna like this car. Um, so I guess I'm going to just spin off the intro for the car like this. So, um, this car is the car that got me into cars. Uh, this was a father and son build. My father and I built this car. We've been working on this thing for 20 years. Um, and now I'm just going to try to finish it, you know, off the way I wanted to finish it. Um, I got a bunch of parts I ordered, you know, once the car hit here, I just ended up ordering a bunch of stuff that I wanted to do to finish it. Um, so let's check this thing out. There you have it. That's my 1969 big block, four speed Stingray Corvette. Maybe a motion Baldwin car, maybe not. Got a lot of details coming. I'm gonna do a whole video, doing a walk around video, uh, talking about the history of the car, um, talking about what's been done to it, what needs to be done to it. Uh, I'm gonna show you pictures, the before, the after, all that kind of stuff like that. Uh, I don't wanna go into too much detail now. I don't wanna give too much away. Uh, I'm just really excited to show the car off. Um, like I said, it is like the car of cars to me. Um, it is my baby, obviously I love all my other cars, but like this is the car, this is like the start of everything for me. Uh, and if you're a car guy, you know, you know there's that one car that's out there that's like, oh my God, that was it for me. And you know what I mean? Like that's the history and that's what made you like a car lunatic like myself. Uh, so stay tuned. If you enjoyed the video, press like, subscribe, uh, watch what we got going on. Uh, and like I said, I got all those other videos coming too with the C for uh and for my beamer guys out there too i got more uh, removal repair video stuff coming too for my parts business uh so thanks again for watching and uh we got a lot coming up so stay tuned